Welcome back to day three, part two, dear darling, dear darlings, video diary, fan of course, New Horizons. Um, well, we're going to start off this part by taking a trip to a different uninhabited island and seeing where the Nick Mars takes us. Not Nick Mars, but Nick Mars ticket. The Nick Mars, go. I don't remember what it was called. Just, just give me the ticket, Orville. Hey, hey, welcome to your one and only get get away from the skies, the Fawn Hollow Airport. How can I help you out today? I want to fly. Roger, by the way, I've got a Nook Mars ticket with your name on it behind the desk, so use that whenever. So where did you want to go? I want to use a Nook Mars ticket. In that case, I'll take this ticket from Tom Nook. I'm ready to get you in the sky right this minute, but let's just check your pack tools already. Can you tell me more? I need to know what Nook Mars ticket is good for. Friendly bastard, right, Dodo. The Nook Mars ticket is good for one mystery tour, a journey to the farthest reaches of the imagination. It could be anywhere from tiny islands to atolls, there are no limits. Just any rock on our... Just any rock our pilot dares to land on. We created a service for true fans of uncharted lands. For these folks, no island could be deserted enough. You can harvest anything you want to bring your tools, and who knows, you might meet your next neighbour. Tickets are made by the next stop of avoid when prohibited. Dodo Islands do not, does not assume responsibility for anything ever. And that perhaps sums up the epic freeway we call the Dodo Airlines Mystery Tour. So you can leave right now, and if you've got your tools ready and everything, what do you say? Time for takeoff. Let's get you airborne. I'm pretty sure I have all my tools, so should be okay. Don't know why the tower will be. You copy? Oh, did not read any of that. Okay, have a good flight, friend. And when you just need to travel, just think, what would dodos do? <laughs> not sure to interpret that, but so be it. Let's see where this mystery island takes us. Two down, docked at the target island, Delta Oscar, Delta Oscar is going. Dodo. <laughs> First, I'm getting your pontoons wet on tour. Let me brief you with a mystery island procedure. First, we want to find this keeper's protocol here. Lumber, fish, fruit, whatever. Yours is yours. You, if you can carry it. Next up, break tool, forget one. I can requisition you with a replacement. Gotta charge you on my so. Also, there's one red line as you need to memorize, like your favorite Latin order. Anything you leave behind stays here. We don't come back to these places. Ever. I actually burn the flight plans afterwards. Security reasons. <laughs> Can't explain more than that. That seems like bad protocol. I think that's everything. Go explore. Begin to travel by yourself. What would dodos do? Meanwhile, I'll be in a holding pattern here. Get in touch when you need tools or travel. Go catch some bees and chop some trees. Sure. Well, there seems to be apples here. Lots and lots of pansies. Can you just pick up pansies? Apparently. Coconuts. Perfect. That's what I needed. My last fruit. A message in a bottle. I'm not sure who left one out here, but... To whoever finds this, I was cleaning a family's DIY recipe written on a piece of paper that I'd use as a bookmark. I entrusted my recipe to the sea and I hope someone makes it. My recipe is yours to try now. Good luck, Midge. Knitted grass backpack. Huh, okay. harvest these coconuts. Unfortunately this island only seems to have apples which I've already got. Let's take a few of these flowers. And we'll just take the iron ore we find here. Because, to be honest, that's the only thing we need. For iron ore, that's pretty good. I also see a cow village up there. I think her name's Carabao. Maybe that's someone else. No, yeah, I think I'm thinking of a Disney character. <laughs> It's okay, uh, well, we'll talk to you in a bit. His islands are actually a lot smaller than I thought they were going to be. Because I can't expect too much. I also can't explore the top part because I can't go up cliffs. It's a lot of iron ore. That's a lot of iron ore. Sorry, iron nuggets. Apparently I just picked up a weed. I didn't need to do that. So 
we have a stack of 30, that's pretty good. But iron nuggets are generally quite useful, so maybe we should get some more. Otherwise, maybe I'll just take a load of flowers. Oh, there's only one other rock anyway, so... There's not really much to do about that. I'll say hello to you. Hello. Oh, Patty. Hi, glad to meet you. I'm Patty. Are you visiting on Matanar Island too? Four and Wow. That's a big trip just to come out with me and this neat little island. So let's get to know each other while I'm here. How now? How now, brown cow? Pass, please don't come over here. I'm trying to hit this rock. What? Can I not shake it when I'm holding the shadow? I guess not, because maybe you'd want to stick it up. Oh, I thought that shadow was. Um, I thought it was a uh, fish. I was about to lose my mind. Oh, I suppose while we're here, why don't we do some fishing? Did I just jump straight onto insect? I'm not entirely sure. Seeing as some insects are going to appear on those flowers, let's not get rid of too many of them. And also, I mainly can't remember what flowers I've already got. I've only been at, had it for two days. I, I really should have checked the recordings. In fact, I'll do that after this episode. Let's see what ones we've got. And where I planted them. More smack corn. Not very interesting. I wonder if it counts as summer on these islands. Or oh, as a honeybee. I've already caught one of those, eh? This fish is just blatantly ignoring me. Notice me, fish. Stop swimming away. Okay, there we go. Another dab. That's a big fish up there. Near the top, if you can see that. Up here now, so it's a vaulting pole. I forget you can't vault over that for some reason. Let's catch a few fish, we don't have to catch all the fish. Just know there's still quite a lot of different types of fish that I haven't caught yet. Bass is not one of them. How much space do I have? Still quite a lot of space. Um. Oh, this is a lot of fish. Try catching some of them. Black 
fast. Got this tiny fish is very fast. It keeps turning away from me. Come on. fish yet, just the uh, same old, same old. There's a lot of fish in this river, my word. Oh! My trusty fishing rod. So I suppose we might as well just make another one while we're here. I don't think there's a downside for making one. Yes, yeah, that's craft something. This is pretty. Oh, uses weeds. Uh, let's go to flimsy one. And then turn it into the sturdy one, the reinforced one. I don't remember what it's called. Oh, just just normal fishing rod. we'd like to fish up otherwise we might just head back there's not really much for us to do here i guess we could pick a load of flowers it seems like these flowers we can place again actually let's see how how does it work can we can we replant these ah you can't you can you can just drop them oh i don't know maybe i'll be nice storage <laughs> options later Maybe let's say one more word to Patty before we leave out on her little excursion. The only thing better than kicking back and chilling on an island would be to, to do it forever. Spending time on an island is the best way to find your inner calm and hug it as hard as you can. If I lived on an island, and I'd be the calmest, most relaxed cow pop star you've ever met. Good luck relaxing. I'm sorry, Patty. Thanks. I'm going to relax here so hard, I'm going to turn into a patty shaped puddle. Then tomorrow, I'll get back to planning to be a world famous pop star. How now? I'll leave you to it, Patty. Uh, where is Wilbur? Let's go home. Bell bottom Zydeco. This is Stotop Socket Wrench. I'm ready to go home. You ready to punt the tunes and fly soaring tulip here back to Fawn Hollow? You possibly be very positive because I wouldn't want you leaving anything behind. So again, you ready? Yep, let's go. Well, firstly, let's donate these iron ores to the crafting of the shop. Thank you very much, Wilbur and Orville. Maybe we can go on another island excursion, try and get some something different this time. Maybe invite a different villager over. First things first. We'll do this. Sell the stuff we don't need. Uh, which is just all of these fish. For only 2,000 bells. Then let's donate some stuff for a store. I'd like to donate. These are for you. Oh my goodness, this seems to be a very thing we need to get started on our shop. And because you help gather what we need to start constructing our shop, we want you to have the honour. What is the honour you ask? We'd like, to, we'd like you, a key figure in making this happen, to pick up a perfect location for the new shop. Well, I will do. Place that shop construction kit wherever you like and we'll get started with the construction. I'm so excited to see the location you pick for us. Alright, I, I haven't actually thought about where I want to put it. I don't want to put it in too inconvenient a location, I think. So probably something, probably on this main island makes sense to me. 
the museum's already over there, so maybe we'll put it over here, near Axe's house. Maybe edge over here, maybe? Maybe by the beach. In this corner here, maybe? That looks like a pretty nice spot. Where else could we put it? Or maybe we could have like a commercial area over here. And then the natural side of the island over there. That's an interesting idea. Yeah, maybe we can just have it like really close by. Uh, not too close by. I do. I, I want things to be spread out a little bit. Yeah, no, I think I'm going to go with my original idea and put it over here near, near, near Axel. See how big it is. This is the spot. This island will become a whole lot livelier. Oh, you know what else I need to do? Let's plant some coconut trees. Wikipedia, that was the wrong thing. Oh, I didn't take a picture on the island. Oh well. A tiger beetle. I apparently have another Pokemon. Oh, it must be for. Yeah, that's it. Planting a coconut. So we're just missing a cherry now. This one might be a little bit too close to the, the ocean, but we'll see. We'll see. Terrible. And while we're over here, let's pick out these weeds. Start clearing up all these areas. Leave them more fruitless be. Maybe we can make that cute little leaf backpack or whatever it was called. I forgot exactly the word. Or like grassy backpack, but I missed one. I don't want to just walk around with a shovel the entire time. Maybe I should do some more fishing, try and get some different fish to donate to the museum. Another tadpole. So you never know you never know how many types of fish that I've been missing just because I haven't been fishing. Just picking weeds. It's only satisfying though, seeing it getting all cleared up. It's like it's like when you watch those gifts of power washing. Or people with a power washers cleaning their driveways or what whatnot. Except, you know, much more slower paced and also probably not as viscerally appealing. Oh my god, you see that orchid mantis up there? If only I could capture you. Unfortunately I cannot weak to be able to jump as high as you go. I'm not sure why I jumped to this island. Let's jump over here, pick some more weeds, another paper kite butterfly. 
Oh yeah, wait, hold on. What um Nick Miles thing did I have? A tiger beetle, that was it. Apparently I picked up a lot of weeds over here, I didn't realise that. Animal Crossing, hopefully. Just a little bit of entertainment. A little bit of a bright light in a dark time. That sort of thing. I think the only place I need to... Oh, that's a flower. I should pick it up. I believe there might be some weeds left on this little island. If not, then I think I've picked up all the weeds. There we go, it's all clear. So only 21 minutes left. I'm not sure if that's enough time to go to a different island, so I might spend the rest of this time just fishing. Seeing what fish I have left to catch. I also need to start playing an item because uh, I've been looking around on Twitter and I've heard of people running into huge numbers of tarantulas. And I was like, why haven't I seen the tarantula? And then I remembered, I'm pretty sure tarantulas and scorpions only spawn at night time. And also, I only thought they spawned in summertime, so I guess that's another thing that's been changed. But yeah, I would love to ca catch a tarantula myself. If it's fish. That's completely the wrong side. Come on. <laughs> this fish is giving me so much trouble. Oh, I'm terrible. There we go. I guess we can get our fishing streak going a little bit again. Was that one I had to collect insects? Sorry. I keep forgetting on it. Oh, take a picture. Tiger beetle. Why don't we just take a picture right now? Let's try a different filter. Soft. With... That frame. <laughs> Didn't even look at the camera again, I keep forgetting. I should have taken a picture of Patty, that would have been cute. I had to start doing that from now. Plant a tree, okay. I think the sea is where you get most of the rare creatures, the rarer fish. Also now I think about it, next time I fish up a trash can, I should just put that on the ground so we can get ants. If it works the same way it does in previous Animal Crossings. Apparently there really are not many fish in the sea today. I see that present over there. Yeah, my trusty slingshot. Oh, too high up. What's inside you today? A tankless toilet. What does that look like? Huh. Well, I guess that could be a good addition to a bathroom. bad at fishing. There we go. Another sea bass. 
Should also catch some insects. So I'll catch that tiger butterfly there. Any fish? Any insects? No. Probably you should not sprint over sea. I might scare them away. I wonder if you can actually fish in that rock pool. Does it let you cast your line into it? I guess not. I suppose that would be a little bizarre. New fish? Ooh, new fish, squid! Wow, it looks so much better than previous ones. Than in previous versions. I caught a squid. I had an inkling I might. Splatoon reference there. There's really not many fish around. Oh, I see you there. That's probably the sea butterfly, it's so small. Sea butterfly. Okay, well that's probably enough fishing. That's um how much space have I got? A bit more space I guess I'll fill it up by first I've gotta put this squid down so I can wrong one. Move it a little bit closer. Lavis is going to be in for real shock when he <laughs> the museum's built. So I guess tomorrow, look at all the things I had to donate. Till then, let's just catch some more bugs for this mission. For Nook Marl's mission, you know. We're getting much better at catching these. Um, let's see if we can find two more butterflies just running around. They're all tiger butterflies apparently. How much space do I have? I have one more space. Perfect. And one more insect. Like this. Not like that. That's not how you do things. Oh, there's another one. I have a chance for redemption. Thing. Ten flowers, okay. So I need to plant a tree. Craft that DIY project. That's not what I meant to do. Excuse me. I suppose I should also talk to Timmy about the shop. Maybe he's got some new dialogue about it. Dear, you put up a shop construction kit. We've got our work cut out for us if we're going to open by tomorrow, but I can't wait. <laughs> so busy all the time. That's not meant to, I'm, I'm meant to sell things first. I don't, I'm sorry, I don't have the inventory space right now. So I sell this, 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 this. What's that? Tankless toilet. Won't sell that. Sell all those fish and insects. 3,000 bells. Perfect. Let's buy another... Cedar sap. Just the one. Then, let's construct... Knitted grass backpack. Yes, 
Let's see if it actually does increase my backpack space. Doesn't seem like it, but it does fit quite nicely, so I think I'll keep it on. He's just started playing Animal Crossing, just as I'm about to finish this, well, this episode. So I think I'll wrap up this episode here. Um, so thank you for watching this uh, day three part two, dear darling, video diary, Animal Crossing, New Horizons, Let's Go Adventure, Fawn Hollow, something, something, more buzzwords, I don't know what I'm saying anymore. But until next time, see you then, bye bye.